Hi, welcome to this video. In this video, we are going to learn how to draw coupled rope, closed coupled rope, and collar rope. Click on subscribe, click on bell icon for new updates. Here, I am going to e explain some couple of things. Here the coupled rope, the maximum span is 3.6 meters. Here we have a sample rowing. I am going to explain how to complete this rowing in this AutoCAD 2020. Draw two vertical lines in between space 3600. Here we have 3600 3, space. This is a symmetrical object. So, if you get the center line, then you can mirror from this side to this side or th this side to this side. So, I have to draw a center line. So, click on this row and go to construction line. Shift plus right click, meet between two points. First point, second point. Now, I have a mirror line. Enter. So, I am going to change this color and also the line type this is my mirror, mirror line or symmetrical line I'm going to trim it here I have first we have to draw a ball so click on offset then enter 225 uh, you should know this side we have to offset because the maximum space is 3600 then I am going to cut here now I have both then I have to draw a ball plate here the ball plate is inside if you want, you can use the center mesh. I am going to use this ball plate in center. So click on rectangle and shift plus 2. Then I have to end the measurement of ball plate is 100, 75. Enter. This is my ball plate. Click on this one and pick this midpoint and pick this midpoint. I can use it here also but I already plan to mirror this side to here now I have to draw rafters so rafter size is 100 by 50 but in section only 100 millimeters we can see so click on line then I have to draw a 30 degree angle so click on it then check it the whether the 30 degree is clicked on it now it's activated the 30 degree then click on this point then draw the 30 degree angle I have drawn this 30 degree angle then you can extend it to the symmetrical line here the ex exterior wall so I am going to offset this one into 750 millimeters if enter then I am going to extend this part now we have the eve now I am going to off offset this rafter by 100 enter this is rafter Next, we have to draw reapers. Reaper size is 50 by 25. So click on rectangle tool and click a point. Then shift plus 2, 50, comma 25. Enter. Now reaper is created. I am going to rotate this into reference to this line. So click on rotate and click on this object. Enter. Pick on this base point. Then click on see reference. This is my reference line. Now I am going to rotate this one into point. 
click this point and this point so drop right at so click on it and snap it this end point then the spacing is 380 or 300 so i can use the path array and select the object enter select the path now the spacing item the spacing 84 then you can use it as 300 or 350 then you can realize that this automatically adjusts these values enter then i am going to enter of picking my roof material so click on this line and pick this point and pick this point this is my roof material so you can extend it enter here we have to draw a balance board so balance board size is shift plus 2 225 comma 25 enter rotate this object click on this point and pick it here the balance balls also drawn offset this value or give this 75 millimeters click on chamfer then we can join it then this value also 25 click on offset and enter the value is 25 so no proof materials or proof materials are crea created now i can remit here i have to extend in this area i have to draw a rich plate the rich plate size is 15 to 150 so click on this point and shift plus 2 give 50 comma 150 enter now this is a rich plate, the rich plate is placed it here, it is correctly placed, click on this one and trim this area, enter. Now I have to mirror this object, so click on the mirror, then select all this object, now I have select all this side object, then enter click on this point and pick this point the source object i want so click on no i have created here i have to put a rich plate so click on offset then give 25 enter so click on line then draw a horizontal line the spacing is 2 to 5 enter so click on this point and midpoint so click on same for then pick it, it here draw a vertical line click on trim the same this is tile and roof material reapers rafters this is pitch plate and wall plate balance board those objects are created now we have to give a breaking line copy it as name it here the breaking line our rope is created a couple row so you can you have to enter those materials so i am going to give those click on this leader This is rich type. Open material 30 degree. Then reapers. Reapers 50 by 25. Then I have to mark the rafter. Click on this point. Then into the rafter. 100 by 50 then i have to mark this balance board we have marked here wall plate so you can mark it also wall plate also mark. so 
so all materials are marked and the here we have to mark another the important material this is called as switch plate 50 comma 150 we have drawn our couple drop so you can mark it here the couple drop click on multi line text then click it here if you don't want this line the couple drop is created now we have to draw this uh, 400 and 4800 maximum spacing close couple drop the difference between this couple drop and close couple drop the tie beam the joist uh, or oh, this this is always called as time beam this is the purpose to the close drop so you can use this click on copy then copy this couple drop then click it here here close couple drop the maximum spacing is 4000 and 800 so you can use this so i am going to delete this area now i have to extend this object up to 1200 so click on this horizontal and enter the value is 1200 now is the spacing is 4800 now i can draw a vertical uh, symmetrical lines click on construction line then shift plus right click mid between two points and vertical line so now i have those objects then i am going to move this part to here right then i have to extend this bit up to here all this all objects are updated now i am going to pick it uh, this object and place it again and uh, again it here so I am picked here then I am going to trim these areas next I am going to mirror this object to select this object enter pick this point and pick this point no so I have drawn this couple row uh, I am going to delete this one then I have to draw here yeah, now I don't want this one now so I am move it here I have to draw a uh, tie beam like as here so you can use this tie beam this is uh, 75 so you can take it as here yeah, offset this 25 in there by one third also I am drawing this one so I am going to pick this object here then I am going to offset this as 100 millimeters enter the 100 millimeter high beam so I am going to trim it here so I have object so I have to extend this object so click on extend then click on this uh, this point enter click on this line and click on this line so the both are extended so click on this string and trim this area and also in this side I can't see this rafter so you can trim it here and also here you can trim it so in section I can see it only uh, this is a tie beam so now I am going to the I am going to give this for this as full plate this is the wall plate and here the tie beam so click on leader post couple door. next one is color drop the color drop is same 
but uh, here the 5.5 meter the maximum spacing and also we have to place a collar this beam collar beam uh, this is the edge height but this beam placed from this point to one third of edge this is the, the main idea of this collar truth so we can use uh, this proof as of here so select this object enter and drag it here the maximum space is 5.5 meters so here we have 4.8 meters so we have to extend 700 millimeters so I am going to use this so this part I am going to delete one so this part I am going to delete this one then I am going to extend so click this object enter click on here then enter the value is 700 enter now so now the 5.5 meters the span the wall plate also placed here we have to to mark the center so draw a vertical line then click on move select those objects enter click on this midpoint now is placed into center now the previously I just done this move and rejoin likewise I am doing here also extend this object select this one enter right I have extended extended now we have 5.5 meter span and the row here I can place this easily here then you can trim it then we want to mirror it so click on this object enter pick these two points enter you can extend it now we have closed uh, now we have color group so I am changing this one the color group here the height is we have to mark the height in. the height is 1.844 the one third of 1.884 you can use a calculator also so QC quick calculator enter so now we have 884 by 3 enter 600 and 28 so I have to move this value this object into 6 point sorry 628 628 enter now it's moved so click on this one I'm going to trim this one enter this and also you can trim it I don't need this one and extend those objects in section I can't see this one
In this video, you learn how to draw a couple draw, close couple draw, and color draw, and putting some details by the object. Thank you. Click on subscribe, click on bell icon for new updates.